Hello, my name is Gary Thomas and I'm a senior analyst here at the Digital Accessibility Centre. And what I do, I test um, and analyse websites for users with low vision um, and colour issues, sort of the type of the thing that people with general, general disorders with, with eye complaints, of which I have one of myself. On this particular website, again, they're using a lot of pastel shades of colours. Um, this one in particular is white text on a green background. To me, that is just blurry. I can't, I can't read the text on, on that sort of platform of colour. Um, but again, we then we test and analyse each of these colours to, to give us a, a hex code value. Um, this is then test against uh, WCAG 2.0 guidelines and see what um, standard it is. So if I take a, if I capture that colour and I'll test this colour here, and that gives me a ratio of 3.2 to 1. Now, to pass a double A um, standard under the WCAG 2.0 guidelines. That needs to reach 4.5. So I'll have a look at this and then I can see then what the hex codes are. So of course white is the row of Fs and then you have the hex code then of the green colour. Now there are a couple of ways you can manip manip manipulate the, um, the hex code and of course you can use a colour palette like this which will then increase the contract ratios. Developers could do this as well to, to maintain and get the perfect colour that will not only increase the definition of the um, of the text being used, but it will also increase the uh, the, um, the contrast ratio so that it passes the guidelines which they are sort of governed by.